What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to show you how to set up Twitch alerts for OBS Studio. So basically, you know, Twitch alerts is, is like it, whenever you actually get a subscriber or something like that, um, you can get a notification. Well, I mean, see so this is for YouTube. I might probably make another video for actual Twitch, but I mean, see, so guys, so go to Twitch alerts. Uh, I mean, so we're going to search it up. So it's, it's the actual website is called Streamland labs.com I just actually say street la land but whatever connect with YouTube I'm going to actually uh, take another account so uh, okay so you can uh, you get all this stuff read YouTube account all that stuff I'm gonna use this account anyway but anyway as you can see you get a lot of stuff that you can you, you get analytics and stuff um, so now you have to go into um, you need to go into alert box so that's where you <laughs> the alerts are so I mean, see, that's like the famous like actual follower alert or something like that. But I mean, see, this is like for YouTube. So you get a subscriber alert, a sponsor alert, and a fan funny alert, and all that stuff. So we got a specific set of subscribers, and you can set up. The, you can actually put another GIF image, like you upload image. You can also browse the gallery. I'm kind of doing that because you, you, there's a bunch of cool GIF images. For example, I would just use this Pikachu image. Um, you can also there's also a sound with it. You have a, so I mean say there's an older sound You can also say of that. So that's called default OGG. It's an OGG file So you can actually put your own sounds also uh, I mean say uh, You can probably put your own sounds, but like for example this one. So I like this one, but uh, it makes sense Yeah, I like that one which just set that up also you can add a variation um uh, so add a variation so you can also add that so we can do call this is test and you can like put something like that you can put also you can customize what actually the message comes in and you can also like you can also like put you can also set this up you can put with this little star there and you can put that uh, um also you can um, change the message here so MLG or something like that, uh, probably um, MLG and all that stuff. So we, yeah, you can also do this for donations. The same thing. Uh, you can same thing with donations, <laughs> sponsors. Uh, uh, yeah, you can also do that. Oh shoot! Uh, you also have a donation to go and all that stuff. I mean, say if you want me to go over that, I can go over that later. But anyway, so as you can see here, we have all that stuff. Also, you add alert animations, so like as you can see here, so we can add slide info up or something. Also, be sure to save your settings after you change all your settings and stuff. So, like, I mean, I'm going to add, add bounce out and save settings. And then when, when you do that, you can just test your subscriber alert and it should have your settings that you applied there. Now, we need to set this up to, to, so that OBS in OBS, which is my favorite streaming software. Also use the I mean see it's not the same for like XSplit or something but I mean see this is specific for OBS Studio because the older version of OBS is different so we're gonna actually first off you need this link so if you launch this link as you see you get a green screen um, and also you can test it so test subscriber alert it also actually works I mean say I can't show it to you it's really hard because it, it will just exit out but as you see we had got that. Um, Okay, so we're gonna need to copy this link, Control C, and paste it in OBS. So what I mean, so in the I mean, so what you need to do is add. Um, you need to add a browser source. So I'm gonna keep create a new browser source, and you can you have to put a new you have to place in the URL, and an automatically chroma keys everything. So for you, so when someone actually subscribes. I'm gonna put this on the other side. We're gonna test subscriber alert. As you see, it should actually pull up like a message and stuff, and it actually works really well. So yeah, if I actually live stream using this account, I would get a subscriber alert. But I would never live.